Alright, fellow gamers and tech enthusiasts, buckle up because we've got a hot topic to dive into today. We're talking about Pentiment, the adventure role-playing masterpiece by Xbox Game Studios and Obsidian Entertainment that's making waves in the console world. And guess what? It's not just any waves, it's high frame rate, buttery smooth, 120 FPS waves on the PS5. Yeah, you heard that right, and we're here to break down what this means for you, me, and the future of gaming on next-gen consoles. So, what's the big deal about Pentiment hitting 120 FPS on the PS5? For starters, this frame rate is like the holy grail for gamers seeking the smoothest, most immersive experience possible. And when a game that's as visually stunning and narratively deep as Pentiment achieves this, it's not just news, it's a revolution. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Let's dig into the nitty gritty and see what's really going on here. First off, Pentiment is this beautifully crafted adventure RPG that takes you back to 16th century Bavaria. You're Andreas Mailer, a journeyman artist caught in a web of murder, mystery, and intrigue. The game's art style alone is a feast for the eyes, drawing inspiration from medieval manuscripts and woodcuts. But it's not just the visuals that captivate, it's the storytelling, the choices, and the moral dilemmas that truly set this game apart. Now, onto the juicy part. A keen-eyed player on Reddit noticed that Pentiment is targeting a frame rate of 120 FPS on the PS5. They even posted off-screen video captures to prove it. This is a big deal because, until now, the game ran at 60 FPS on Microsoft's own Xbox Series XS consoles. That's right, the very creators of the game haven't unleashed its full potential on their platform yet. This begs the question, why the PS5 and why now? Let's talk tech for a second. Running a game at 120 FPS means smoother animations, sharper responses, and an overall more immersive gaming experience. But it's not just about the numbers, it's about the commitment to pushing the boundaries of what next-gen consoles can do. And Pentiment achieving this on the PS5 is a testament to that commitment. But here's where I share my two cents. While it's fantastic to see games like Pentiment pushing the envelope on frame rates, it's essential to remember the core of what makes a game truly great, its story, characters, and the emotional journey it takes us on. Yes, 120 FPS is impressive, but it's the heart and soul of Pentiment that make it stand out. That said, this development raises some interesting questions about the future of console gaming. Will we see more titles targeting higher frame rates on the PS5? How will Xbox respond to this discrepancy in performance? And more importantly, how will these technical advancements enhance our gaming experiences? In conclusion, Pentiment hitting 120 FPS on the PS5 is not just a win for Sony or Obsidian Entertainment. It's a win for all of us gamers. It's a glimpse into the future of gaming where the limits are pushed and the experiences are richer. But let's not forget at the end of the day, it's the story, the adventure, and the connections we make within these digital worlds that truly matter. So what do you think? Is Pentiment at 120 FPS on the PS5 a game changer for you? Or is it the narrative and art style that draw you in? Drop your thoughts in the comments below because this conversation is just getting started. And remember, whether it's at 60 FPS or 120 FPS, the real magic of gaming lies in the journey it takes us on. Let's cherish that, frame by frame.